Habakkuk 2. <laughs> Habakkuk waits for God's response. I will stand at my guard post and station myself on the lookout tower. I will watch to see what he will say to me and what I sh and what I should reply about my complaint. God's second answer, the Lord answered me, write down this vision, clearly inscribe it on tablets so no one may easily read it. For the vision is yet for the appointed time, it testifies about the end and will not lie. Though it delays, wait for it, since it will certainly come and not be late. Look, his ego is inflated. He is without integrity. But the righteous one will live by his faith. Moreover, wine betrays. An arrogant man is never at rest. He enlarges his appetite like Sheol and like death. He is never he is never satisfied. He gathers all the nations to himself. He collects all the peoples for himself. Better coffee down there. You are currently listening to another Nero Zero Ninety Nine channel on YouTube. Bible reading. The five war oracles. But all of these take up a taunt against him with mockery and riddles about him. They will say, Woe to him who amasses what is not his. How much longer? And loads himself with goods taken in pledge. Won't your creditors suddenly arise, and those who disturb you wake up? Then you will become spoiled for them. Since you have plundered many nations, all the peoples who remain will plunder you, because of human bloodshed and violence against land cities, and all who live in them. War to him who dishonestly makes wealth for his house to place his nest on high to escape the grasp of disaster you have planned shame for your house by wiping out many peoples and sinning against your own self for the stones will cry out from the wall and the rafters will answer them from the woodwork Woe to him who builds a city with bloodshed and founds a town with injustice. It is not from the Lord of armies that the peoples labour only to fuel the fire and countries exhaust themselves for nothing. For the earth will be filled with the knowledge of the Lord's glory and the water covers the sea. Woe to him who gives his neighbours drink pouring out your wrath and even making them drunk in order to look at their nakedness you will be filled with disgrace instead of glory you also drink and expose your uncircumcision the cup of the cup in the lord's right hand will come around to you and utter disgrace will cover your glory for your violence against Lebanon will overwhelm you. The destruction of animals will terrify you because of your human bloodshed and violence against land cities and all who live in them. What use is a carved idol after its craftsman, craftsman carves it? It is only a cast image, a teacher of lies, for the one who crafts its shape trusts in it and makes idols that cannot speak. Woe to him who says to wood, wake up, or to mute stone, come alive. Can it teach? Look, 
it may be plated with gold and silver, yet there is no breath in it at all. But the Lord is in his holy temple. Let the whole earth be silent in his presence.